Phil, I am so excited to meet you. I'm excited to meet you. And we're gonna get to eat today. We're gonna start eating because your show is called Somebody Feed Phil, so we need to feed you now. That's right, it's an imperative. Let's do Bang Bar. This is one of my favorites. Good morning. Hi. We're gonna have two wraps today. One is gonna be chicken, and one is gonna be eggplant, and one is gonna be pork. Okay. I've never had bang bar, so this is a first. Thank you. Here's to you. Mm. You're ahead of me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we have a saying when we go out to eat, pork wins. I'm so glad we got this snack in first. You're fed slightly. You're my kind of person. You're into it. You you like it. I love it. And I wore white. That's a risk with eating stuff like this. We're gonna head over to Noodle Bar to see what you love there and really talk about the new season. Okay. All right, Phil, you have season seven out on Netflix. Yeah. I think it's our best. How do you decide where to go? I mean you've been to I think 32 cities now, 40 with this yes, season. Right. A couple of criteria. One where would I like to go? Two, where other people tell me I should go. That's kind of it. So are you often going for the first time? Is it kind of split? You've been certain places before? Or? There are places I've been that I can't wait to show you, and there's places that we discovered together. So where are some of the places you took us this season? Yeah, uh, Mumbai, India. I've never been there, have you? No, I haven't. Incredible. You think New York has hustle and bustle? You haven't seen anything. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's a bold statement. It is. <laughs> you also went to Iceland? Yeah, I love it. Iceland, interesting cuisine. I mean, Scandinavia in general, very right. different from anything we have here. Listen, here's a generality about the world. I think you can get a good meal anywhere now. People would say you have the best job ever. I do. I do this live tour. I'm doing 25 cities. You're going to yeah. be here April 13th at the Beacon. Probably the biggest theater I've done in America. You come here a lot. A lot. This is one of my favorites in New York. That is really good. Look at that gorgeous ramen. Mm. Oh, Thank wait a minute. You. We'll save the ramen. <laughs> That's my oh, noodles. look how great that looks. Wow. Give us a minute. So what's your favorite word to use to describe food? Delicious. Our editors make fun of me because I say delicious too much, so thank you. In addition to being able to watch your amazing show on Netflix, you have a children's book coming out with your daughter. Your family, you always incorporate them in your show, and then now this. It was her idea. She said, Dad, I love uh, how the kids love your show. Why don't you write a children's book? And I said, good idea. You do it with me. And so we did it together. It's called Just Try It. And it's an important thing to teach your children so you don't get to be our age and not want to try new things. Exactly right. <laughs> You're amazing. It You're was amazing. so nice to talk to you and eat with you today. I'm this so excited. This is just the beginning. Yes, I'm excited to see the new season and see you on tour and buy your book and all the things. So thank you for hanging out with us today. Go to philrosenthalworld.com for all the info about all this. We got it.